Deciphering the Rorschach Inkblot Test, Insights and Controversies The Rorschach Inkblot Test, developed by Hermann Rorschach in the early 20th century, is a widely known and debated projective psychological assessment tool. Over its history, the test has been both praised for its insights into personality and criticized for its lack of scientific rigor. This video covers the origins, uses, changes in attitudes, and current status of the Rorschach inkblot test, while examining its reliability and validity scores. Hermann Rorschach, a Swiss psychiatrist, introduced the inkblot test in 1921 as a means to explore the unconscious mind. The test consists of 10 symmetrical inkblots, which individuals are asked to interpret. Rorschach believed that responses to the inkblots could reveal underlying thought processes, emotions, and personality traits. Initially, the Rorschach inkblot test gained popularity among psychoanalysts and clinicians as a tool for diagnosing mental illness and understanding personality dynamics. However, its subjective nature and lack of standardized administration led to varied interpretations and inconsistent results. Over time, attitudes toward the Rorschach test have shifted. While it was once widely embraced in clinical settings, particularly within psychoanalytic circles, its credibility has been challenged by advances in psychometric testing and empirical research. Despite criticism, the Rorschach inkblot test remains in use within clinical psychology, forensic evaluations, and academic research. It is often employed as part of comprehensive psychological assessments, alongside other standardized measures. In clinical practice, the Rorschach test may be used to gain insights into a client's cognitive style, emotional functioning, and interpersonal relationships. However, its use is often supplemented with more objective and reliable assessment tools. Assessing the reliability and validity of the Rorschach inkblot test has been a subject of ongoing debate within the psychological community. The test's reliability has been questioned due to its subjective scoring system and the lack of consistent administration procedures. Interrater reliability, or the degree of agreement among different scorers, has been found to vary widely across studies. Critics argue that the Rorschach test lacks construct validity as its theoretical underpinnings and interpretive guidelines are not firmly grounded in empirical research. Additionally, concerns have been raised regarding the test's ability to differentiate between clinical and non-clinical populations and its susceptibility to cultural and contextual biases. While proponents of the Rorschach test argue that it provides unique insights into individual psychology and interpersonal dynamics, empirical evidence supporting its validity remains limited compared to more widely accepted psychological measures. The Rorschach inkblot test continues to be a subject of interest and controversy within the field of psychology. While it offers a qualitative approach to understanding personality and cognitive processes, its reliability and validity have been called into question. Despite its limitations, the Rorschach test persists in clinical practice and research settings, albeit alongside more empirically validated assessment tools. As our understanding of psychological assessment evolves, continued scrutiny and research are necessary to determine the appropriate role of the Rorschach inkblot test in modern psychological practice. Disclaimer. This video is designed for educational purposes only. It is not intended to offer legal, medical, or psychological advice or treatment. The information presented herein is based on research and general knowledge and should not be construed as a substitute for professional consultation or diagnosis. Individuals seeking assistance with legal, medical, or psychological concerns should contact a licensed professional or relevant authority. Viewer discretion is advised.